Now, our Macdown is a really great way of creating documents to share with other people or even creating analysis documents that you can go back to in the future and thank your past self for making really um, comprehensive notes about what you were doing and why you were doing it at each step of the analysis process. But it's also a really great way to create um, particular kinds of documents that um, there are lots and lots of templates that have been created to create, for example, APA formatted um, manuscripts or um, CVs, those documents, the templates to create CVs or even slides. So what I want to show you now is um, how you can create our markdown documents from templates. So if you go and create a new file and choose our markdown, you notice that the default is creating a standard document that you can um, output to HTML, PDF, or Word, but there are some other options here. So if you want to create slides, there are a few um, default um, slide formats within the Markdown presentations, but there's also packages like Zarangan um, that um, create pretty fancy looking um, slides from Markdown. Um, Shiny, uh, Shiny apps are another Markdown related thing that you can um, put together interactive um, visualizations in an online web app. But templates um, are really, really useful. So there are lots of packages where people have created our Markdown templates that allow you to create customized documents for a particular purpose. And I have lots of templates um, in my um, template list because I have installed these particular Markdown um, related packages. This is not an exhaust exhaustive list, but um, Vitae is a package that allows you to create CVs. This um, companion um, was a package that Alison Hill created for her advanced markdown workshop um, that is um, useful. Um, you can create dashboards, um, which are a little bit like shiny apps. Um, tutorials, Papaya allows you to create APA formatted articles. Um, there is a format for creating a vignette for a package that you might be writing. Articles is a package that has lots and lots of templates for different um, journal formats. Um, all the way down here. Tuft is a package that allows you, um, is useful if you're writing a book in, in this particular um, format. Um, here's some more different CV formats from the Vitae package. Um, and Zaringan, as I was talking about before, is a way to make pretty fancy slides. So these packages are definitely worth playing around with. They can save you lots of time um, in the sense that all of the formatting is embedded in the template and you just put your content, content in and say knit, right? So let's, I'll show you, um, let's make an awesome CV from the, using the Vtype package. So you say, um, CV test, and we'll create a new document. So what you can see that it has, oops, I've called it CU test. We could have a cute CV, that makes sense. Um, so you can see on this document that this YAML, the piece of, um, of code that appears at the top of the Markdown document is lots bigger um, and contains all kinds of it. Um, identifiable information that you might want to put on your CV. But down here, um, you can add CV content as you see fit, right? So let's see what happens if we knit this document. Ah, it has created a, oh, it's still thinking. Here we go. Oh, it's created a PDF. Oh, that is fancy, right? 
So the key to using these markdown templates is that you can just change um, the details that are there in the templates, right? So let me just quickly say that we want to customize this right Oops, I'll say that of course you can change whatever details you like but also take out whatever details you don't want to be in there. So let's say I don't want my email or my phone. I just want my Twitter and GitHub. Don't really use LinkedIn, right? So you just delete whatever things are um, not relevant. And then we knit again. Oops. That. Oh, maybe I took out something key. Let's undo what I just did. All right, will it let me? Oh, it might be the at that I added. Let's try that. So I don't want LinkedIn. I added an at to my Twitter and it might not have liked that. Let's try using that. Let's see, it's still thinking about it. Oh, there we go. Excellent. So you can add details and take details out, but the formatting. Um, of these templates allows you to make pretty fancy looking things without much effort at all.